length check the last time that I had my hair like out and showing you guys like a video of it basically was probably early this year or late last year I'm not completely sure but my hair has grown out a little bit I won't say a lot um, I will say that my hair has gotten thicker I feel especially in the middle especially in the crown and that may just be you know natural or whatever but I have been using castor oil for at least a good year now I do feel like my hair is gaining you know length or whatever but I just feel like it's getting thicker faster than it is growing in length so I have a couple photos I think and I think I need my uh I know I need my ends clip and y'all already know about the front the front of the hair uh got damaged when I was wearing half wigs and I had cut the hair that's that video that I'm talking about so I had told you guys that I had um basically singed my hair <laughs> wearing half wigs a straight half wig and I was uh adding too much heat and the biggest thing that I noticed because when I could hear it sizzling I'm like okay my hair is fried literally was me not letting the um the heat tamer because I always use the uh not redkin but is it Tresemme? Heat tamer. I've been using that stuff for a good, probably like a good decade. Even when I was relaxed, transitioning to natural, wearing half weeks, all of that stuff. And I basically, I didn't let it dry long enough. So when I passed my hair through with the flat iron, I, it, it was like snap, crackle, pop. Like I just knew. So that's when I cut it off. My hair is a decent, I guess my hair is a decent length for how long that I've been like really trying to grow it out and keeping it moisturized. Like my hair soaks up a lot of moisture. Like it'll feel, you know, moisturized and soft and everything probably for the rest of the week. And then after that, it's like dry and I have to pick up something to moisturize it. Either it's like some castor oil or some sweet almond oil I really haven't been using coconut oil on my hair I haven't been using coconut oil at all up until now I haven't been using it in my hair though I've been using it on like my body as a moisturizer but not in my hair so I'm thinking about going back to the basics which is like coconut oil uh, co-washing every week um, herbal essence Hello Hydration Shampoo and Conditioner. My hair loved that stuff. Especially when I had my TWA. But as my hair grew out, I just felt like my hair was super moisturized. So I might go back to that. I have been recently using um, the Aussie, what is it, 3 Minute Miracle stuff. I've been using that for probably like a two months maybe, off and on. But y'all know I used to work at um, Beauty Brands. And I had so many shampoos and conditioners. I could wash my hair every day. I wasn't going to run out of anything anytime soon. But now, it's literally been years since I worked there and, like, got free product and, and or bought product. So now I'm really running out of stuff. Like, all the Redken products I had, all that stuff is pretty much gone. So now it's a good time for me to, like, really not experiment and test out new shampoos and conditioners. But I'm pretty much out of stuff is what I'm trying to say. And the products that I bought from um, last year's Natural Hair Expo down in New Orleans, pretty much a lot of that stuff is gone as well. So I've been running through some products. So I feel like my I've been keeping my hair moisturized. I just feel like it's growing extremely slow. I want to try the inverted method, but I haven't sat down and did it yet. I do kind of do like scalp massages every once in a while, but... I don't know I don't know I've been keeping my hair in a bun or a ponytail probably for the last I want to say April May June yeah four months four months I've been keeping my hair pretty much in a bun ponytail half wig that's about it so or a hat and I just call it a day so yeah that's about it 
I'm just going to finish twisting the rest of my hair and that'll be it. That'll be, yeah, that'll be Yeah, that'll be it. So go ahead and recommend me like some uh, shampoos and conditioners that you like. If you have the same hair texture, that's even better. Um, I don't know. I want to try the Miel organic stuff. But I don't know. I don't know. I just really want this front portion to like really start thriving. But that's about it.